Hey, it's Gabe with API Nation. Today, I'm gonna to show you how to connect KV Core to iCloud. That way your iCloud is always updated with your latest KV Core leads and contacts, but also your iPhone and your iPad. And it all happens automatically. It's super easy to set up. Let me show you. First thing we're gonna do is go to apination.com to set up this sync. And once we're on apination.com, we're gonna click Discover Connections. And then we're gonna scroll on down until we see KV Core. You'll see there's a bunch of different real estate apps on here. Any of them look familiar? If you're using any of them, go ahead and click on them and you can see all the integrations available for those apps. Here's KV Core, click on that. And then I'm gonna click on iCloud to begin setting this up. So you can see there's two options here. I can do iCloud to KV Core and KV Core to iCloud. And both of these are covered under one subscription. So you can set this up as many times as you want going back and forth and it's all covered under that flat rate. I'm gonna go ahead and set up KV Core to iCloud first. I'll hit activate. And I'm gonna click connect KV Core account. Now I'm gonna authorize. And that's it because I was signed into KV Core on this browser, it automatically signed me in and passed me through. Now I'm gonna connect iCloud. So I'll click there. And you can see here I need my Apple ID and password, but it's not a normal password. It's asking for an app specific password. So where do you find that app specific password? Let me show you, it's super easy. So to find my app specific password, I'm actually gonna to have to create it. And to do that, I'm gonna to go to appleid.apple.com. And I'm gonna sign in. And it's gonna ask you to authorize using two-factor authentication. You're gonna see this pop up. So if you're using a PC, be sure to check your iPhone to allow it. And it's also gonna send a code to either your Mac or your iPhone, whichever one you're using. So there's that code, I'm gonna type it in here. And this is just to get into my Apple ID, great. Okay, so I've signed into my Apple ID, I've authorized, and now here's this box under sign in and security for app specific passwords. So I'm gonna click on that. And it says I can generate an app specific password. So I'm gonna click, I'm gonna go ahead and name mine API Nation. That's what I'm connecting and hit create. And there is that password. Be sure to copy this before you hit done because this is the only time you're actually gonna see these letters. After this, it's gonna be hidden. So I'm gonna copy that, hit done. And now I'm ready to connect iCloud on API Nation. Now that we have that app specific password, we're ready to go back to API Nation input it and then configure and launch here we go i'm going to type in my apple id and then i'm going to paste that password we just generated and hit connect all right there's a few options here as to who exactly is going from kv core into icloud i want to sync everybody so i'm going to click sync all contacts on first run if I wanted to filter those contacts a little bit, I could. I can click on this type filter and select maybe just buyers and sellers and renters. Let's do that. If you wanted everybody, you would just click all. Or if you're just onboarding a new agent and you just want them to have the new agent and vendor, you could do that also. So a lot of brokers will do that. They'll set them up so that they get the vendor and agent numbers so they have everybody they're doing business with. I'm gonna go ahead and go with all actually. I'm just gonna sync everybody over into my iCloud so I have everybody in my phone that caller ID is always accurate. You can also filter by source. So maybe I only wanna send people over from Facebook ads, or maybe I only wanna send people over from an open house or whatever source I have set up in KV Core. I'm gonna leave it the way it is and just send everybody over. And now I'm gonna come on down here. And this is just how it's mapped. This is what's available from KV Core, first name, last name. And it's all synced automatically. If there's anything else you'd like, just click it on the left-hand side. Maybe I wanna sync over lead origin, and I'm gonna sync that over into notes here in iCloud. So these are the iCloud notes on the right hand. I could also sync that over into something like company, just so I have it in iCloud. And then I'm gonna actually sync lead type into job title. That way I have that in iCloud as well. And when I'm looking at it on my iPhone, I can see the information as well. This looks great. I'm gonna go back to the top and hit activate sync. Great, the sync is now running. And now I'm gonna set up the second half. So I'm gonna click up this KV Core logo at the top and that's gonna take me back to the KV Core syncs. 
I'm going to click on the iCloud logo again. And then you can see now we have one active sync. That's the one we just set up. And now we need to set up its partner, iCloud into KV4. So I'm going to click activate. And because we've already connected both apps, we're just passed right on through to the final page. Again, I'm going to sync all contacts into KV4. I'm just going to double check the mapping here. This all looks great. Address, city, state. Perfect. If I wanted here, I can actually sync notes into KV Core. So if I wanted to make notes in my iPhone, I can have those synced into KV Core and they'll show up in the notes there, which is super handy because that means I can actually add hashtags to my contacts in iCloud. Just add them in the notes field. Those will get synced into notes in KV Core. They'll get applied. So this way you can actually just hashtag somebody on your iPhone and it'll put them on a smart campaign in KV Core without you having to do anything else. This looks great. I'm gonna go ahead and talk, go to the top and activate this sync. There we go. I'm gonna click on my sync so I can see them both. I have two syncs now running, iCloud into KV Core and KV Core into iCloud. So now every new contact or lead and everybody I currently have in KV Core is getting synced to my iPhone, my iPad, and vice versa. My caller ID is going, it's gonna be super accurate and all that time copying and pasting and importing and exporting and just managing the contacts it's all gone, it's off my plate, and I can focus on business generating activities. So if you have any questions or ideas, give us a phone call, shoot us an email, we're API Nation, connecting the world's applications. We love doing this stuff.